Greetings in the name of Jesus Christ. Today's thought is from Genesis chapter 12 verse 4. Continuation of yesterday thought. So Abraham departed as the Lord had spoken to him. And Lord went with him. And Abraham was 75 years old when he departed from Haran. Yesterday we saw that the Lord gave promises to Abraham. At the same time God asked him to do something. He had to come out of his father's house, his country, his own place and he has to go to the place where God is showing him to go. Here today this verse says, So Abraham departed as the Lord had spoken to him. He did not know where he is going. In the book of Hebrews, Bible says, By faith Abraham went to the place where God was showing him even though he did not know where he is going. The Lord did not give him much details about where he is going. But God told him, you have to go where I am showing you to go. So today also we are seeing here, Abraham departed according to the word of God. In what basis Abraham left the place? I, I believe like this even though he did not know where he was going but he knew one thing the Lord one who gave promises is faithful he will take care of me he will lead me with that faith only Abraham departed his own place and going to the land which he never knew that place everything new new place new people new journey new path but still he believed in the Lord and his word. Today the Lord wants to encourage you. Maybe you are also going through a path which you, which you have never gone through it. Completely new path, new journey, new people, new place, new resources. Everything looks new. Maybe because of all these things are new, maybe you are going through a time of fear. But the Lord wants to encourage you that one who promised you is very faithful. He will bless you and He will keep you as a blessing. He will make you as a great nation. Because you are obeying to the voice of the Lord. You are continuing your journey. So you will see the hand of God. God will fulfill all His promises in and through your life. Shall we do a word of prayer? Let's pray. Jesus, encourage your children. Maybe they are going through a new path. Lord Jesus, bless them. Lord, let them believe in your word. And let them believe in your power. Lord Jesus, it's not about the places, it's not about the resources, it's not about the people. It's all about you and your word, O oh God. You are faithful in your word. You will fulfill your promises in your children's life. Let this day be a day of miracle and encouragement. Bless them, Lord. Let them increase more and more, O oh God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God will bless you. Amen.